In this video, I'll guide you through the process of creating a custom UDP configuration using the HTTP Custom VPN app. This method is ideal for those looking to achieve faster and more secure internet connections. Before we dive in, be sure to like, share, and subscribe to stay updated with my latest tech tutorials. Let's get started. First, open any web browser and navigate to the SSH UDP website. Once you're on the homepage, locate the hamburger icon, typically found in the top corner, and click on it to expand the menu options. From the list, select UDP Custom Servers to proceed. Next, you'll be directed to a page with various server locations. Choose the location that best suits your needs and click the Select Location button to move forward. Now, you'll be prompted to fill out an account form. Enter your desired username and password, solve the CAPTCHA, and then click the Create button to finalize the server setup. Within seconds, your server will be ready, and you can copy the server details for use in the HTTP Custom VPN app. Now, return to your mobile device's home screen and open the Google Play Store. Search for and download the HTTP Custom VPN app. Once installed, launch the app and you'll be taken to the home screen. Here, make sure to check the UDP custom box to enable UDP configuration. Next, input the SSH UDP server details you previously copied. For further customization, click on the plugin icon at the top of the screen and select UDP custom settings. Adjust these settings as needed, then return to the home screen. With your settings configured, it's time to save your configuration as an HTTP custom file. Click on the plus icon, then choose Save Config. Give your file a name and save it. Now, you can either click Connect to start the VPN connection with your current settings, or import the configuration file you just created to initiate the connection. That's it! You've successfully created a custom UDP configuration for a fast and secure internet experience. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more tech tips and tutorials. Thanks for watching.